Hey, how you doing? This is Todd, and I'm so glad that you have uh, joined us for this weekly get-together of our VO Marketing Pro group. And uh, we are going to be getting to your update coming up pretty soon. And I'm also going to be sharing some analytics from our website, our voice roster, the direct email marketing that we've been doing, and all sorts of things like that. So uh, stay tuned for that. That'll be an exciting update, and I'll try to keep uh, the information as succinct and clear as possible. We'll see how I do with that. But first, I want to talk to you again about something that I've talked with you about before, but I think it bears repeating. Here at VO Marketing Pro, we talk about marketing, direct email marketing specifically, as an illustration that we use is fishing, the fishing illustration. Let me explain. Ponds, streams, lakes, in our illustration, are where we do our marketing. In other words, we do marketing with video production companies, ad agencies, voice rosters, etc. That's where we do our fishing. That's the water where we do our fishing. Our bait is our emails, our filling out of the contact forms, our cold calls. But especially with our emails, it's our subject line, a catchy subject line, the links that we use within our, uh, our emails, also um, the demos, workflow, anything that we provide in there is meant to be bait for people to say, ooh, this looks like it's something tempting. I want to, I want to check this out. Lastly, the fish are our clients. So we use this fishing illustration. Now, in all honesty, I don't really like real fishing. Oh, if someone will bait my hook, they'll guarantee that my time spent out on the lake or whatever fishing, I'll get some fish, I'll get to catch, you know, have the thrill of catching some fish, uh, and they'll take the fish off the, the hook, then I guess I could say that I like fishing. But in all honesty, I don't like fishing. And in fact, I don't even like the taste of fish. I don't even like to eat fish once they're caught, even if they're caught for me. That's not real fishing. If you have somebody bait your hook, if you have them guarantee that you're going to catch fish and you're not going to have to put in the time and effort, and they'll even take the fish off and clean it for you, that's not real fishing. But here's the truth. Whether you're fishing for real fish or fishing for clients, if you don't go to the lake or stream or pond and bait your hook and then wait for the fish to come, you will never catch fish. You'll never catch anything. The same is true of marketing. So if you're fishing, real fishing, and you just sit home and think about fishing, but you just watch TV and you know putts around the house, you're never going to catch any fish, right? I mean, that's just obviously clear. And the same is about marketing. If you think it's a great idea, if you talk about it and whatever, you think it's, it's a super plan, but you don't do it, then you're never going to catch any fish, that is, any clients. You've got to go fishing to catch something, and you have to do marketing to catch clients. I was reminded of this again this week when someone in our group got a warm reply that said something very close to this. Um, it's not verbatim, but it's very close to this. The person replied back to this guy's email and said, your timing is impeccable. I have an immediate need. And then the potential client went on to talk about the need that they had and the job possibility. This is the importance of always getting as many poles in the water as possible. You are bound to get nibbles and bites and eventually you're going to hook something. You really are. If you market all the time and you get lots of emails out there, you are bound to hit somebody at the right time. I can't tell you how many times it's happened for me like this VO Marketing Pro member. How many times this has happened? I can't even count them uh, over especially the last five years. Somebody said, hey, great timing. Oh, wow, this is perfect. We need somebody and they sent me a job or they sent me an audition. But here's the thing, I'm fishing all the time. In fact, fishing is so important to me, I spend over $15,000 a year 
on direct email marketing alone. So here's the bottom line. Remember, perseverance, patience, and persistence will pay off, whether you're fishing for real fish or you're fishing for clients. So again, I hope that's an encouragement to you and that you'll hang in there and do the work and keep on doing the work. So let's try to break down these analytics just a little bit, and I'm using a cheat sheet so that I can stay on uh, task here. Now, we've been making cold calls on your behalf, and my second oldest son, Drew, is great on the phone. He does that all the time and has done it for many years, and so we've put him in charge of getting a hold of video production companies and ad agencies on your behalf, the voice roster behalf, uh, with regard to making cold calls. This week, he was... Uh, out on business for a few days, but he did make 10 phone calls this last Thursday, just a couple of days ago. And he got a hold of 10 people and five were very promising. Now that doesn't normally happen, but this time five, 50%. He uh, got good replies from some folks in Texas, Utah, Tennessee, Minnesota, and Missouri. And uh, they responded positively and we sent them a specific email out explaining more about our services. So hopefully that will continue to yield good ROI and we'll start to book some jobs from Drew's work on cold calling. With regard to our website, uh, checking the details here, July 8th through the 14th, July 8th to 14th, we had 171 visitors to our website. 60 of those clicked on our voice actors. So that was great. Now, here's the breakdown. 60% of them were from Canada. That's kind of interesting. 35% were from the U.S., 20% from the U.K., 2% from India, and 1% from Greece. So that's the breakdown of our website traffic. Now, this week, uh, we sent out 1,900 direct emails for people to check out our uh, voice roster. And so... Um, We've gotten 11 replies so far, but they have a tendency to kind of come in more throughout the weeks. So 1,900 went out this week on your behalf, 11 warm replies to our direct email marketing for our roster. Now, specifically, this week there were 31 warm replies for you folks, two auditions, one potential job, and two jobs were booked. So that was your week for this week, the VO Marketing Pro members. Keep up the good work, we're making progress. My update for this week, I had three warm replies uh, and auditions, two new clients, and of course, two new jobs from those clients. My platforms this week, I had a very busy week and a good week. My platforms, $2,557 for my platforms. Direct email marketing was at $7,932 and 50 cents for a grand total of $10,489.50, $10,489.50. So there you have it, that's a full week. We've done a lot of work on your behalf. Keep doing the work on your side, staying encouraged. Let us know how we can help. We are always glad to hear from you. Get in contact with Joe or John or me and uh, we'll keep plugging along and keep fishing. So have a great rest of your day and we will talk to you soon.